welcome or welcome back. Um, I have a Timu haul for you. Today it's um, a bunch of gifts. Um, I've got a lot of people in my life with birthdays in April and May. And uh, I hope everybody's doing all right. I'm going to be honest with you guys. I'm not doing that great. Um, I'm having a lot of mental issues right now. I went to the doctor on Tuesday and I'm still waiting for my blood work. There. Um, I'm still waiting for my blood work. Um, got a pimple patch on. It almost makes it look worse. Um, but that part has at least, um, calmed down a little bit. I mean, I don't want anybody to worry about me. I'm doing what I can and what I need to do to deal with it. But I just, I guess I felt like I should share that um, I'm feeling anxiety and overwhelm. Okay, so I do have a Timu haul for you. This is a really uh, great Timu haul. I've had it sitting here. Thank you so much for coming and hanging out with me and supporting me and bearing with me and understanding me and seeing me and relating to me. I know, I know I'm not the only one with these types of issues going on. This, this order here um, is a lot of freebies for lack of a better word, I, I, Timu. Um, I will have, okay, in the description, I will have the links to everything, and um, I will have all of my codes, my influencer code, my affiliate code, my farmland and fish land codes. If you guys are interested in becoming an affiliate or sponsor or influencer or whatever they are calling it, check that out because if I can do it, you can do it. And this haul is, I, I am excited about it and I have been waiting on it for a long time. And it's my farmland prizes, which this is the best farmland prizes. Like this is the most excited and happy I am to receive farmland prizes yet. And fish land. This is my favorite prizes I've ever received from farmland or from fish land. So you know what it means. I've got a new farmland code I've got a so I've got a new farmland friend code. So check it out. Get add me as a friend. Um, so those will be in the description. And then this 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 here, um, I I think I used credits and it was a there's a spin the wheel item in here, and I think it cost me like eight dollars for everything. I, I can't even remember. It, will, it really was um, inexpensive, but I have priced these things and I can't, of course I can't give you the price to the farmland prizes, but I can provide a link and I will in the description. To it, to it finally. This, um, so this cost me $4.09 and I did get a price adjustment mini handmade, handmade casual bag and it is a crossbody. I guess I should okay so so we've got the zipper here and inside look there's a little oh there's a cute little pattern there it's like a, it's almost like, it's a, it's a canvas on the outside. And that's canvas too. It's just not as thick of a canvas. It's cloth. It's like a cloth there. It's really nice. And I could probably fit my phone in there if I wanted to or wallet or whatever. This is more like of a burlap type texture. Here's where it says the handmade. I need to. I mean, I guess I need to redo my fingernails, but I'll, I'll do that later. Mini, what's it say? 
Mini handmade casual bags. And then, isn't that pretty? I like that right there. The little bird. Okay, and so then there's snaps. Snaps open. And you got a pocket here. And there's that same little cute little pattern on the inside. And here's your crossbody strap. Cute little pattern on the inside. Here's Monster. And then the strap here is like this and it can be adjusted. I'm not going to adjust it, but I know that this can be turned into a crossbody for somebody who is plus sized that would work for that. And I mean, you could, you could, you could, you could get your phone and your little uh, coin purse, you know, you, you can fit your essentials in here. And yeah, it will go crossbody. I just don't want to adjust it um, because this is a gift. So I do like this, it's nice. And I paid $4.09 and got a price adjustment. And I think if I, I could be wrong, there's so many deals and so many sort of reward, like ways to get uh, better deals that I kind of get them all mixed up in my head. But I feel, I think maybe that when I got the spin the wheel, I had like a sort of mix of things to pick from that I had to have at least $15 or something like that. And that's, um, but I have somebody that I know would maybe hopefully like this. There's Monster. Always here to help. You don't got nothing for you today. You don't got nothing for you today. But I do think this is nice, I, I do. And I hope that the person can uh, use and, and like that, that I'm gonna be giving that to. Okay, and this is also a gift. I feel weird doing these because I feel like if the person that I'm giving the gift to watches this, they're gonna know. But what can I do about that? Um, uh, this is $2.90, I paid $2.99, and then I got a price adjustment and ended up paying $2.69. And that's a little coin purse, elephant. Not real leather. <laughs> and then just, a nice long strap there it just opens up like this they've got a little and there's oh I didn't know this that's nice Th there's a little uh, chain in there to I don't know hook your keys to or something it feels nice and soft and suede inside it does feel suede pretty Pretty decent uh, size there. Oh, I'm gonna put, put this thing back in there to help it keep its shape. This is a repurchase and it is a dollar forty nine. I paid a dollar forty nine, I got a price adjustment down to a dollar forty one. And again, this this is is a gift. I think I'm pretty sure. I'm not a hundred percent sure, but I'm pretty sure that almost, except for the farmland prizes, that that er everything I've got here is a gift. And I I, I have and that has helped me out a little bit getting these gifts and putting them together has 
um, helped me cope a little bit and, and made me feel a little bit more uplifted. I, I guess I just prefer getting gifts for other people at this point because I feel like I've got plenty. You know what I mean? Like, I feel like I've got plenty. Beautiful Revitalizing Oils Cherry. It's just the oil pen that you, I should have thought to bring my actual one, but I didn't. See, there's the little stick there. And then you just paint it on your cuticles and it's really easy. And I prefer this to the kind of, almost kind of like chapstick kind. Uh, but anyway, that will be a gift. This is a gift. I paid $1.49. You guys see Monster? I feel like living his best life over there. Living his best life. Oh, hair things from Timu. Glasses from Timu. I think this pimple patch is from Timu. I'm pretty sure. This little leaf earring from Timu. That one. All the earrings over here from T Moon. This is my new one, and it's reflecting my mood. So I've been, <laughs> I've been wearing it a lot, but I do really like it. Oops, it's kind of caught. It's kind of caught on that other one that I've got there. Anyway, yeah, okay. There you go. You can. I love these. I love it. I love this. This is my new favorite. This is my favorite earring for the time being until I start feeling more myself. This is the emo earring. <laughs> this is not from Timu. I don't know why I'm showing that. Uh, this shirt, neither is the short shirt. Um, here's a gift I got from Mary. Mary from Retail Therapy on a Budget, my friend Mary. Hi, Mary. And April. And it doesn't say I okay. I mean, if you look at it and you look at it as the black, as the letters, can you guys see it? Or I ho, whichever one. But once she told me <laughs> that it's sun and stars, like I can totally see the sun and stars. So that's. That's how my weird brain works now. Oh, and my, um, my husband picked this up for me as a surprise to kind of cheer me up. He says it looks like Sawyer, it's a Squishmallow. It's got a little sun. Anyway, isn't that sweet of him to have done that? He brought it home to me last night once he got home from work. He works late at, into the night. So. so I need to kind of fix this up a little bit, I think. Foo-foo it up. But it is very soft. And look, we've got little glitter ears. Isn't it cute? I feel a great amount of confidence that the person who this is for is going to love this. This is a gift. Paid 99 cents, got a price adjustment down to 89 cents. Skeleton unicorn earrings. I saw Tammy uh, hauling it with me, Ma. I saw Tammy, she's been getting a lot of stuff to give out as friend mail, and she's been telling it, and I saw something. Um, 
I saw something that she got for somebody and I'm pretty sure I know for who and I was like crap because I got that same thing for that person and I was like oops you know but I'm glad that I I'm glad that I saw it anyway she's so sweet I love her she she's like I don't know she's we're probably not all that different in age I'm gonna be turning uh 49 in April April 28th I'll be 49 and I don't know how old Tammy is but um, I look at her and I watch her and I just get a very motherly vibe from her and it's very comforting and she's just very sweet. Um, so here's another earring. There's two of them, but I'm just going to show you one. These are a gift. Okay. I'm going to take forever. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Okay, so it just goes through there and it'll look like a knife through your ear. Or a sword. Now I gotta get the thing back on. Okay, and it'll look like almost like a medieval sword. Anyway, that's cool, and I'm pretty sure that this one is stainless steel. These ones paid $1.69. Got a price adjustment back down to $1.34. This I'm divided about whether or not it's a gift. <laughs> I might keep it. Um, paid $2.49. It is now discontinued. Or else I would just say I'll just get myself one later. Um, it's called a poison, poison rope umbrella. And actually probably will keep it. It'll be really, really cute with, um, I think it would be really, really cute with my fairy house. That I hauled not so long ago. Really nice. Really nice detail. So yeah, I, I'm probably gonna be keeping. I'm I'm gonna be keeping. I got just a plain white bag on this one, guys. These these bags, I'm reusing these bags like this. I've gotten a good amount of them. And I even gave some away to my mom's friend, Susan. Um, so I still have a good stash of these and I just use these because I haven't been getting them lately. Um, and I just use these as my trash bag and my organization bag and my whatever bag. This is the one I got on Spin the Wheel and it is SJ0687. And it is originally $9.74. But on the spin the wheel, I got it for $3.90. I'm just gonna show you, show you the whole thing. So it's this bag pack and it's really nice. Um, almost almost feels almost like a, a burlap again but sturdy canvas material here nice little trim faux leather trim around here all these cute little mushrooms two pockets one two here's the back of it the back of it's just plain then we got our straps um adjustable straps And then you open it up. And I'm not sure if I can. Okay, so we just have 
one pocket. Okay, so it's just big in there. And it's almost like a, I don't know how to describe this lining other than like almost like umbrella. So I guess it would be waterproof. And we've got the lighter colored tan uh, in there. And I know that my mom likes that. Like she likes her purses to be a lighter color than black so she can see in there easier. Um, and then there's this one little pocket here. Other than that, there's no pockets. But then, got this rope here. And oh, oh, I guess you have to do it yourself. You have to do it yourself, That's how everybody would say. So I'm thinking this goes through, you, you tie this, you put this through here, and then you can, you know, like a sachet, like a big giant sachet. So that's, yes. So you have to do it yourself. Okay. And prizes. And like I said, this is my favorite prizes I've ever won. So I guess we'll start with what's on top. Usually I am let me just say, usually I'm a smaller purse girl. I like crossbodies, smaller purses. But um, this is an exception. And I'm going to use this purse, this purse around Halloween. And it is awesome. And maybe, you know, when I feel like, when I feel like using it, I will use it. And it's huge. It's huge. Anyway, so there's this. The back. Oh, it glows in the dark. It glows. It glows in the dark. So where you see the green, I believe, I believe it's where you see green and white is where it's going to be glowing in the dark. So there's the back. The bats. We got a little zipper here. Fits my hand, could fit my phone. Pretty big pocket here. I'm gonna keep these little protectors on the handle for now. Here's this side of it. Oh my gosh! How cool! So, and I love this little detail here. And look at the nice stitching. But anyway, look at all of this. We got bones, spiders, bats, eyeballs, skulls, severed hand, zombie hand, brains, brains. Yeah, you guys get a good look at that. Look at how just how awesome that is. Talk about a statement. And then we've got these real sturdy, real, really well made, like a cloth material. And then open it. And we got this real nice, thick, probably, uh, long enough to make a crossbody out of here let's see though i don't see why you would i don't think i would want to make this a crossbody but yeah let's see let's see baby and of course you can Take, you can just do it like this and without the without this part it comes up it comes right off you saw Let's see uh, 
um, come across and met some new uh, plus size people putting out content as well. So I feel like it's important for me to show whether or not, yep, it can be a crossbody. It can be a crossbody. I'm, I'm a size 20 US, so that's 2X in US and 4X in Timu. So it can it, it can be crossbody on me. Right at the hip at its longest point. And it's big enough that you could carry around a severed head if you need. <laughs> but seriously, you could if you needed to go on a homicidal rampage and stick a, that might be a nice costume idea. Like put a like a mannequin head in there or something. Um, but I wouldn't want to ruin the purse with all the blood. So let's see. Okay. I'm not being serious, you guys. I'm totally being sarcastic. That's my humor. I've kept it a little bit to myself, but I'm starting to say, forget that. Just be yourself, um, put it all out there. And I, I, I haven't not been myself, but I haven't just shown you all of my craziness at the same time. So I'm starting to get to where it's like, okay, let me show you my craziness because that's how it is. All right, so, but no, I'm not serious about doing a severed head. I'm serious about doing a costume and a fake one, but not really because, again, I wouldn't want to mess the purse up. Anyway, so there's a pocket in here, one zipper pocket. And there are, and it's very impossible to see because it's black inside here, but there are two, here, two pockets. It's one. And pops out. So you got a good amount. You got a huge amount of width and depth in this purse. You can get a lot of stuff in here. And I love it. I love it. And it glows in the dark. So all the green and all the white will glow in the dark. I'm so happy with this. And it's, it is one of those rare occasions where I love the, a big purse. I, I'm very, very, very extremely picky about purses. I get it from my mom. Even worse about wallets. Like, it has to be a particular way. So, I do want to say, April did a good job because I actually like that purse. I really like the purse that she gave me. And that's a feat because I am very particular. But this is one of the few big purses that, I mean, I'm so happy that I was able to get this in the farmland price. Because I probably wouldn't have gotten it otherwise. I love it, and it's really great quality. It is really great quality. So any of you for horror fans out there, um, I highly, highly, highly recommend this. Even if you just wanna have a cool aesthetic for only Halloween time. Uh, huge, huge, huge bag. And then this other farmland prize. Yes. It's, it might be a little hard. It is a blanket, but it's not a typical. It's okay. My mom has has these, and she's give she's gifted me 
one, I think a Christmas one, and I have one from like back when I was in high school. And it's like, I don't know how to explain it, but it's this thick, um, oh, I just don't know how to, what, woven almost material. And it is not the wave where you see all the, okay, yes it is. It is the wave. Okay, I was about to say, you, you're not gonna be able to see the people about to die, but you can see the people about to die. <laughs> in, case, in case you didn't know, you know, um, Mount, uh, Adrian Miller was actually talking about this the other day. I don't know the artist, but I do know that um, this is Mount, oh shoot, okay. okay, sorry. This is known as the wave. And what apparently some people don't notice when they're looking at the big, huge photo is that there's people in boats here and it's dark. I mean, I've mentioned how I have a dark side. I am a fan of horror. I have a morbid sense of humor about certain things as you've seen in this video. Um, but these guys aren't gonna make it. And some people don't realize that that's part of the, the wave. They just see the big beautiful wave and the mountain in the background. It's a, it's a little bit of a grim situation happening with these people in the boats. Um, okay, and then and you see this other side? It's just a plane, but it, like, look at that. That could be, you could flip it over. Okay. So I can't really see what you're seeing Oh, geez. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay, so there's the big giant wave happening. Sorry, you guys. But yeah, Adrian Miller was talking about this. I can't remember in what context? I think she'd hauled something. And I thought, I got one of that. I got something with the wave. Anyway, it's pretty substantial and more than significant enough to cover this couch. It, it was, it was going to be before. I just thought that that's all it could do. No, like this is a full on, like it goes the whole width of the couch and this is a three seat cedar couch here and then that's this much that way this way so it's pretty significant size and we've got some asian writing here i don't want to say chinese or japanese because i honestly don't know But anyway, I'm very pleased with this. I'm very happy with this. I'm so excited to, when it arrived to get it. And I, I love and appreciate Adrian Miller because she's gotten me in touch with art and uh, I love her stories. Yay me, I got some awesome and it is nice and warm. It, it, unlike these that I also love, these aren't very warm. I got this from Timu too. It says, I love cats. It's got Sigmund Freud quote on it. I, I guess it says Sigmund Freud down here at the tail. It says time spent with cats is never wasted. I am assuming that's a quote of his. I don't know why else his name would be on it. monster um 
So, but this is, this is, these are soft. They're nice and soft and the cats love them. And, but they're not very warm. They're thin. This is actually kind of warm and it's really nice. So, and I will, I will have both of these farmland prizes in the description. So if you guys really want them, now they're not inexpensive at all. Either one of these. I think this is like 20 something dollars and I don't know, 10, 15, but I think well worth it. Um, I don't know that I would have bought these on my own that I, if I hadn't have won them. But I'm so thrilled. Sometimes the prize, the prize selection you get is not so hot. This time around, I scored big time. So thank you guys. Thank you for hanging out with me and listening to me sort of complain and rant. Um, hard to explain. Like, I feel like, I almost feel like a pod person. Like, something else is in charge of, of me right now and it's not me and it's like I'm on the outside looking in getting really frustrated and PO'd at myself um, and wanting it to be over soon <laughs> wanting it to be over soon so um, please send me your positive vibes and and well wishes if you if you can if you don't mind and I'm sending them to I'm sending them to you as well. I wish everybody um, all the good things. And thank you so much for watching. Thank you for uh, being a friend. And I love it. I love you all. Monster's taking a nap. So is Sawyer. I'll probably try to throw in a little thing of him in, at the end there so you guys can see. Bye, nutty buddies. <laughs>